went to the B class yesterday. I have another video posted about that. And he stressed the importance of continuously feeding your bees through the winter. This isn't something that we had been doing, so we're going to remedy that today. And I've looked at all different recipes and uh, watched YouTube videos. This is the recipe we're going to go with. And it says to start out with 16 ounces of water. We're at the garage. I try to have everything I need when I'm at the garage, but lots of times I take things home to clean them and they don't quite make it back. They make it back eventually, but not always when I need them. Okay. Steve got me a wood fire going in the cook stove. Uh, he says I gotta bring this water to a bowl. So I'm gonna shut you guys off and let the water come to a bowl. I got some bubbles. Hang on, some fail. <laughs> Okay, I got some bubbles coming up. It's beginning to boil. I probably need to check it, make sure I still got plenty of wood. No. No, we got some embers, but no, we got no plenty of wood. Some of these scraps. Perfect size. Burn up pretty quick. That's really the downfall. So everybody has a different way of doing things. Um, this works really great. I'm sure it's dangerous if you use it. Use every precaution. Read the label. Um, if you don't feel comfortable with using it with the wood stove, don't use it. Most people that are seeing this video are like me and they've looked at 10 million things on YouTube and all over the web. What I do for myself is if I'm comfortable with it, I do it. If I'm not, I don't. I'm not promoting it. I'm just saying works for me. Okay. Now we got a bowl again. That's that's you know, working with wood is a lot of fun cooking on this wood stove. We do it because we enjoy it. We don't live here. I would if I could. But the wood burning stove it, for us is a hobby. We enjoy cooking on it. The food tastes fabulous. The cast iron pans, you can't beat them. Um, it's just what we like to do. Alright, this stuff is very thick. I had to take it up off of the main heat. It's very thick. Got one more. I've been adding this cup by cup. And that's the last of it. I don't know if I can get it mixed in or not.
very thick, very thick. I think that's enough. It's good. I'm going to burn it. Yeah. Alright, let's move it up here. Okay. Let's see. Okay, remember guys, this is my first time. So how this works. Put it in the plates and then we'll smoosh it out. It's pretty. <laughs> pretty crystally. It's gonna take more than my four, huh? There you go. This is going to be a fun pan to watch. Let's push one out and see what we get. We can add more to it. And if you're cooking it on a Stove at home, gas range, electric, you have more control over the heat. And I'm sure you can keep it from sticking a lot better than I do. I don't think that's going to work. Let's smush this one down first. Okay, one thing I'm seeing is I think it would have been better if I had smushed it to start with. But you get the idea. This is what you do. So I'm going to sign off and get this complete. And I'll pick back up when we go to the beehives. Okay, let's check these hives. They're all getting steep. There's the honey right there. Don't go no further. <coughs> oh, he's on you. Hmm.
That's a five. <laughs> 